Hi, I am Michael Buckoff. I am the founder, owner, and the materials writer for the seven-step system to pass a TOEFL IBT. And it's Happy Halloween to you. You made a comment over my website, and you made the mistake maybe making the comment the day before Halloween, and today it is October 31st, 2015. And let's take a look at your situation here. So you say, I want to join your seven-step speaking course, but before, I'd like to know about the price and validity of the course. I mean, is it for three months, six months, or lifetime access? Uh, my course is you use it as long as you need it. That's kind of how it works. So if you go to my website and you go to onlinetoeflcourse.com, if you click on join, what you have to do is, once you click on join, you'll see the information about paying for my lessons. So, you click on the subscribe button, you create your PayPal account, you make your payment, you get your password, your username, then you start the course. You're paying me on a month-to-month -month basis, so after you make your first payment, if you only want to use my course for one month, you can cancel your subscription immediately and I will give you access for the next 30 days. Now a lot of students, they may need to use my course for more than one month, so if you want to use it for two months, uh, you do nothing. PayPal will automatically bill you each month. Right, so let's say that you join my course today, which is October 31st, your billing cycle goes into the next 30 days, which will be November 30, so if you don't want to um, use my course after November 30, you want to cancel your subscription at PayPal. So that's kind of how it works. So going back to your question, uh, it is not lifetime access. It is not six months or even three months. You use the course as long as you need it. You can use it on a month-to-month -month basis. That's kind of how I set it up. All right? Now remember, once you make your payment, if you use my course for two months and then PayPal bills you for the third month, but you don't need to use it for that third month, you can just send me a quick email and I surely can issue a refund. No problem. PayPal allows me to issue refunds up to 60 days. All right, so that's kind of how it works. And uh, good luck to you. Remember, use English as much as you can. You want to be reading the newspaper, listening to radio, television, and even start taking notes on what you read and what you listen to. Get it down in note form, and then using your notes, start speaking and writing about that information. That's going to be very helpful for you. And of course, using my online TOEFL course, that's going to give you access to over 700 vocabulary, pronunciation, grammar, reading, listening, writing, and speaking lessons. So little by little, you can improve your score. Now, if you're only focusing on speaking, what does that mean to you? You'll be focusing probably in the pronunciation and the speaking parts of my course. And guess what? You can actually send me audio files. You can do them online at my 7-Step Voxypop discussion group or if that doesn't work, you can email me your pronunciation pretest, and you can also email me your independent and integrated speaking practice test because you want to focus a lot on speaking. So my job is to help you get higher than 26 points on the speaking section of the exam. That's what I'm going to try to do. Now remember my rule. I do have one rule. My one rule is you can only send me one speaking practice test each day. Remember that. I'm keeping my course inexpensive and I can do that by limiting the number of speaking practice tests. And think about it. If you go to a lot of other online courses like Noteful or you go to Test Den or you go to Magoosh, You've probably seen their advertisements. None of these guys even allow you to send speaking practice tests. And guess what? Their courses are going to be a lot more expensive than mine. And I even listen to your speaking. I evaluate your speaking. I've graded almost 6,000 speaking practice tests in the, in the last two or three years. So that tells you you're in very good hands. I have over 22 years of online and in-class TOEFL teaching experience. Okay, V? 
I hope I've answered some of your questions. You feel a little bit better about my course. I apologize for the the mask here, but it is Halloween, and what can I say, right? So uh, good luck to you, and all the best to your high-scoring TOEFL success.